Here, grab a seat. You even brought a book, huh? May I have? Same as always. You just don't give up, do you? Oh, come on, let's get closer. We can't see anything from here. No, too early. So we're just going to sit here all day? Patience, John. I have a feeling this is more than simple blackmail. We'll be close when the blackmailer leaves, and then... Go! What a pretty sight, this. Head trauma. Fatal. Gravity is cruel like that. It's a rather frivolous accessory for a military man. Shame it's all bloody now. He was stabbed several times before he fell. The shape of the wounds suggest a curved blade. A key, and where there's a key, there's a lock. The knife is missing. It's almost like he's dancing. Dancing the dance macabre. No signs of life, no pulse. I'm declaring Corporal Ridley dead. Please move along. The police are on their way. Everything's uh, under control. Is it now? The General's own son has fallen out of the tower, and not without help, it seems. I need to inspect the scene, and quickly. The Corporal? He ordered me not to let anyone inside without telling him. But now... Wait, are you saying it's a murder? A brief examination of the body was enough for me to conclude that he was murdered by a blade of Ottoman origin. He can't possibly be so certain. Oh, I can be. The corporal suffered deep stab wounds which were inflicted with great force. They were made by a knife meant for cutting, not stabbing. A curved blade such as an Ottoman Jambir or a Gurkha Kukri. I haven't seen any Gurkhas on the island, so the conclusion is quite obvious. Amazing. You do seem more than competent. All right, go in. I'll wait here for the police. Did you see anything suspicious? No, sir, nothing. Corporal Ridley had to attend to some private matters upstairs. No one went in, no one came out. Oh, but that means the killer is still inside. Are you sure you want to go in alone? I'm not alone. I have my friend with me. Your friend? You mean, your gun? There's no one at... Never mind, I'll be fine. The killer's gone, vanished into thin air. Can you smell the body odor, John? Someone's been hiding in here. Someone sweaty. Unless it's a laundry chest. But then it's a different mystery altogether. The case of the vanishing sweaty pantaloons. This cigarette is still smoldering.
exactly 100 man gears. Killer didn't touch them. Gonna join the Navy after all. That'd make Mycroft so happy, you know. Shut up, John. This blade is a naval officer's dirk. Sharp and well cared for. The edge is covered with blood, but the tip is clean. Ridley was attacked by his blackmailer, but before being pushed out the window, Ridley managed to wound him. The killer must still be bleeding. Come on, let's take the rope down. I'd rather take the stairs. Ah, what a bore. So what happened? Was there anyone upstairs? No, the killer escaped. We're dealing with a carefully planned assassination. Do you know if the corporal had any enemies? Someone who would want him dead? No. Uh, none that I know of. But then again, there's always the Ottomans. They'd want all of us soldiers dead, I reckon. What can you tell me about the deceased? We were from the same unit, stationed together at the barracks by the bridge, but I can't say I knew him well. Maybe someone at the barracks could tell you more. was a rough landing. Could you help me? Sorry, but I never heard of this. 